Hi guys, very welcome to Mentor, yet another video podcast. As always, I hope you're doing absolutely fantastic out there. So today on the podcast, guys, we're going to learn how to open the front door of a 737. We're going to talk about why it's important, what to think about and what to look out for. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so opening the front door of an aircraft is actually something that forms part of a new pilot's line training. And the reason that we find it so important that we actually have to sign off that we've taught you how to do that is because it is potentially dangerous, all right? Uh, the front door is a heavy piece of equipment and you're standing on top of a couple of air stairs that still does not have the uh, security railings attached properly. So there is a chance, especially in windy conditions, that you might fall off, all right? So it's really, really important that you follow the following steps to the letter and you do it correctly. Now, in the video that's coming up, I am going to show you the actual aircraft and how I actually open the door, right? But I will not show you how to extend the air stairs. And the reason for that is just because of safety and security, okay? When we get to the aircraft in the morning or in the afternoon, if it's been standing for a while, the aircraft is going to be completely shut with all the steps retracted, right? And that is because the aircraft has to be secure and we have to make sure that no one is tampering with it. And this is also why we're not showing you how to operate the air stairs, but I can show you how to open the actual doors and stay tuned to the end because I will also show you how it looks when we ret retract the air stairs afterwards. Enjoy. The first thing we do is to make sure that the slide is not armed. We do that by checking through the window. Then we grab the handle, make sure that you can feel the detent inside and turn the handle around. Make sure that the handle goes nicely into position. Second thing is we take the handrail, open it, the little switch beneath the handrail to release it and attach it to the holder inside of the door. Now we can start moving the door. Find the handle, hold the handle firmly, hold the other handrail and swing the door open until it clicks into position. Now we can find the release switch of the second handrail, move it up and connect it to the inside holder. And that is how we do that. To close the door, you first click the gust lock. That will release the door. Then we remove the handrail from the inside holder, move it into position. There's a little metal piece that fits into a hole and then there's a little release switch that you have to find. Click it in and move it down. Make sure that it clicks nicely together. Now we move up, take the handle, hold on properly, move the door in, take the second handle and then let the door fall into position. Leave the door there. We take the second handrail, release it from the holder, move it down. Once again you fit a little metal piece into the hole and then we have to find the switch which is located here put it in and then click the handle together. Then we close the door, you find the detail, click it into position and then verify that both the top of the door and the bottom of the door is flush with the aircraft. Now the door is properly closed. Okay guys, now let's have a look at the stowing mechanism for the air stairs. Here you can see how the air stairs are being raised and now they're being folded in. You can see the two metal rods that are tightening the air stairs together there to make sure that they fit snugly into the body of the aircraft. It's very important to make sure that both the handrails are properly stowed before you start retracting the handrails, otherwise uh, there can be some major damage to the air stairs. I also want to take this opportunity, guys, to tell you about some precautions. Do not try to open or close the aircraft door if you have any kind of back problems. Also, be very careful to make sure there are no contaminants on the uh, air stairs before you close or open the doors. If that's the case, then contact ground personnel and make sure that they remove the um, contaminants before you try to open or close it. Guys, I hope you have liked this video. Make sure that you subscribe to me on Instagram, on Facebook, and have an absolutely fantastic day. Bye-bye.